you were shooting for Carl in the middle of a forest. In Corbett. In Corbett. Yeah. Jungle mein. Huh. And there was a sweet little stylist who was working for Dharma at that time. Huh. By firstly, the plan, huh? huh. like the most scripted pranks. Yeah, yeah. Pehle, John was told what he has to say. I was told what I have to say. Huh. We sat at the breakfast table. We waited till he entered the stylist. I won't take his name, poor guy. He's probably watching this huh. uh, and is still going to a psychiatrist for what happened to him, <laughs> the trauma. Huh. We started talking about ghosts. And you should have seen like close up of that guy's expression. Cut to he's looking. Ye lo kya baat kare? You know, I heard some sounds. For two days, he played this. We'd be talking about these ghosts that are in the resort. Right? So that guy was already getting palpitations. Then the third day, bhai, he took a walkie-talkie. He taped it under the guy's bed. In a corner at light volume. Right? Think of the planning boss. And then at night, around 11.30 or 12 at night, We've turned on the walkie that's connected to it and we've started saying his name in the walkie. We're like whispering his name and going like, Koon chahiye tera koon. All of this drama is going on and three of us are laughing away and we're doing this. Believe me, in 20 minutes, that guy was out of his room with his bag packed. And despite us telling him it was a joke, we're showing him everything, he has left the next morning. He has taken a bus from that bloody village and gone back. <laughs> तो देहरादून इनसे मैं घर जा रहा हूँ मैं नहीं रहूँगा यहाँ पे